You're watching Hope Channel around the world. Daybreak and delegates get ready as early messages in the first session of Christ Living in Adventist Youth Summit here in Teachers Camp, City of Pines, Baguio. Inspiring messages, breakout sessions, and outreach programs await the delegates as the program proceeds the whole day. The day begins with the devotional delivered by the General Conference Associate Youth Director. Pastor Hiskaya Misa. He stressed his message in the importance of two Our words in the life of a Christian salvation and service. Life. If we sin, what we should do? If we do sinning, what should we be doing in order for Jesus to enter into our hearts? Pathfinder, First, Director of the General Conference, Elder Jonathan Tehel, lead the young people afterwards sharing hot news fresh out of the oven. And we prepare and we finalize the Adventure War book. You can download it. You have all the awards for the adventures that have been approved at the General Conference up to 2011. According to his report, there will be a new Pathfinder organization which will be implanted by July of this year. He stressed that the format will lead young people to a true spiritual leadership training, which will equip them in the preparation for God's ministry. Delegates during the program were blessed and were enlightened about the direction the General Conference wants to pursue in preparing our youth. Some of the delegates even expressed their thoughts on the summit. In the afternoon, delegates were divided in two clusters to attend breakout sessions led by resource speakers and to participate in an outreach community service within the near areas of Teachers Camp. Delegates who were part of the outreach activity participated in sweeping the streets, collecting garbage, and distributing bottles of water. According to the delegates, they wanted to create an impact to the community that Adventist youth are always ready to help. Dito pala sila sa magandang influence rin para sa mga lalo na sa mga tao dito sa Baguio. And most especially, we can find true joy through serving others. Yeah, masaya, masaya. At uh, maraming mga tao natutuwa sa atin. In fact, ay uh, mga nagtihin sa atin, nagtatanong at uh, ginagawa natin. Yung kapitan doon ay grabing tuwa nila. Kala nila mga mga college student lang ito. Pero nung malaman nila na came from the whole Philippines, uh -huh. they were so amazed. Then tuwang tuwa sila. Medyo nahiya nga. Siyempre, mas uh, sunan Adventist na mga kabataan, mag magandang impact to na ginagawa natin para sa kanila. Kasi at least nakikita nila na meron tayong unity na nagkakaisa tayong mga Adventist para mag-build up ng mga positive na programa kagaya na ito. Maraming natin. Lalo natin ito sa outreach program natin. Ay, magandang umaga rin. Ay, magandang hapon rin po. Napakaganda po itong mga to para po ma-enhance din po yung kakayaan po ng mga kabataan. At ganoon din po makatulong po sa uh, mga barabaranggay at makapromote din po kung ano po talaga ang uh, katunguhan ng Adventista na layon po sa pagkakaisa at kagandahan po ng barangay. Um, bayan. Uh, ano po masasabi niyo sa programa natin? Dito? Very good, very good, very nice. Uh, nagkakaisa po kami. Unit, yeah, we are united in one. Uh, are in one. Power of one. Power, Power of one. one. Power of one po ito. Dito sa Baguio. Tapos... All these and more to come in the P1 update of Hope Today. This is Joey Cano reporting.